And now it's time for our last hubster. Her name is Caroline. She's actually a Southern transplant yeah. who moved up here to Boston. What do you know? And the way that she's learning the city is by telling beautiful stories on her social media. You can find her online at Make Boston Home. And she's checking out some great spots for us. Take a look. Hey, Hi, Caroline. Hi, I'm Caroline Berry, the content creator behind Make Boston Home. Today, I'm gonna to take you through a day in the life in downtown Boston. To start, we're gonna head over to Bakey for breakfast across the common. Bakey is located right in the heart of the city at 151 Tremont Street. All the babka and pastries are made fresh daily in-house, and they took me behind the scenes to make the buttery chocolatey goodness. First, they roll it out, then they add the butter, chocolate spread, of course, more chocolate, braid it, and bake it. It's just perfect. Next, we headed to Haley Henry Wine Bar. Named for her father, this woman-owned wine bar is located right in the heart of downtown as well. He passed away a couple years ago, unfortunately, but he had a very big hand in kind of like helping me. He was coming down to help me paint and he ended up falling from the ceiling and he broke like 19 bones. And he dented the bar right here. So when he passed away, his, his plaque went there. Now that he isn't with us, it's more important now than ever that the name was that to begin with, but after he broke 19 bones, it was going to be like that. It had like fell through the ceiling and of course you're going to name the bar after <laughs> yeah, him. Exactly. After having a glass of wine, I visited one of Boston's oldest treasures, Brattle Bookstore. Family owned and operated since the 1940s, but dating back to 1825. We met the owner, Ken, for a quick conversation. And I hope to do this until I can't do it. I figure my oldest grandson is three. So I figure if I can last another 20 years, he can then take over. <laughs> he can okay. take over. Well, All my granddaughter. Is over. <laughs> this is a page from a book that was printed in the 1490s. The only time we have ever closed it on a day that wasn't raining or snowing is last year. There was a day at 10 below zero, and we closed it mainly because we knew we'd have customers who would sit out here, and we were afraid they'd get frostbite. <laughs> so you heard it here first. Brattle Bookshop is open rain or shine with a collection of over 250,000 books, maps, prints, and unique items. Thanks for following along for a day in downtown Boston with me. For more, remember to follow along at Make Boston Home on all social channels. Back to you, Billy and Jenny.